You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. Thanks for stopping by today. I truly appreciate it. I do need to say thanks to Spin Master for sending these to me to check out on video. They sent me the three different sizes. The Ultimate Dragon Pack on the left, the Dragon Multi Pack in the middle, and then the Dragon Pack on the far right. So this one has... Six dragons and 36 trading cards. Three dragons and 18 trading cards. And this one has one dragon and six trading cards. Now what I plan on doing, well, pretty neat packaging if you take a look at it. I will kind of give it all a little spin here. I see some pull me tabs here. Start here, pull. And you smash, collect, battle. And then start the ultimate battle. I guess there's a game involved. I'll have to learn about that. Well, let me do this. I'm going to open up all the packs. And I kind of lay out uh, everything that's in each one before I open them completely. So I'm going to take uh, the small pack here, open it up, and work my way down the line here. So let's do that next. All right, pack number one, smash to battle on the top. So, let's see, is there any kind of pull for the plastic? No, so you have to work your way through the plastic. I will cut that off. There's the bottom, by the way. You see Spin Master logo. Dragonite. Okay. Pull here, all right. Okay. Easy enough to do. There is your card pack. There is your little egg. All right. Let's just temporarily... Set that here. Let me get that one here. That's what's in that one. And then the card pack I will cut open. I will take a look at all these with you. But first, I'm doing something a little bit different today. I'm going to just lay out the cards. Okay, so that is in pack number one. Now the next pack, this one is a uh, collectible and trading card game, 70 plus dragons, the three dragons. Okay, so pretty much repeat information all the way around. Okay, and then there's the pull here. Okay, so this packs it a little bit differently. There's a dragon right on the top. Okay, is there another pull here? I don't want to destroy this too much, but it looks like... Oh, there we go. Okay, so there are two more, so you get... Of the three. This has two little packets in there. I didn't see any of that in the other one. Okay, so there is that one. So now you can kind of see what's in each one. Kind of neat how they package those. And then let's get so there are two individual packs in this set. They do have this also saying Dragomon's Dragon Cards on the black. It's kind of neat how that's packaged. Okay, so here's the cards. Okay, so let's get to the the ultimate. Okay, I'll show you all the cards in a moment. Let's get to the last one here. We kind of took a look at it. It's neat how they package it. Looks, it looks like it's scales, like dragon scales all around it on the top there. That's pretty neat, Okino, huh? Right, let me make a little more room here. Bring the camera back and out. This way I can slide some things over and fill the space better. Here we go. You go there. You go there. Ooh, is there anything else in there? No. Okay, I thought there was something sneakily hiding in there. Okay, last one. This one. Oh, there's two pull tabs on this one. Was that the same on the other one? I did not see. And then there's another one down here. So now you're working your way in. Ooh, look at this. It's like a tray. It's like an egg curtain. Ooh, they have two that are already just out. They give you another two brochures in there. And look at that pack of cards. Woo! This is in a clear bag, huh? Let's get this back here so we can kind of just take a look at all three. So that's basically what you get in each pack. All right. Look at the cards. Pretty neat looking cards too. I will just put those there. All right, so kinda get a good idea. You get these, 
two, four, six in this one, three in that one, one in that one. So let's, uh, let me move these out of the way now. Check out number one in more detail. Okay, so the cards have like this dragon scale on one side. And then, okay, let's see. So this says Boulder Strike 50. There's a plus 20 in the upper, or a 20, not plus 20. A little similar, looks like zero. And then verses with a little egg there. So I'm not sure what all this means. But let's just check them out. Okay, ooh, look at this one. It has a really neat printing effect on it. I know it's hard to see, but let me see if I can get it in the light just right. Almost reflective. And then, now this one, let's see. Okay, so then there's cards that have both sides, razor bark. Seven here, 50, and then this side is seven, 30, 20, okay? And then this is the Dragomon's Wild Thorn Nature Power. Common, rare mystics, legendary mystics. And then that's the app. Ooh, I'm gonna have to check that out. Okay, so these, you can hear it rattling inside, so let's just see how easy it is to smash. I'll just smash in one hand, so, ooh, can't. Press? Ooh, I don't know, let's just see, let's just smash. Ooh, okay. I guess you smash bottom down. And then you peel, look, I'm opening my egg. There you go. Okay, so I have a little green guy in there. So it matches the card. I wonder if that is the trend on these. What do you think? Think they're all gonna match the card? The egg was pretty neat with the multicolors and the way it was done. I do like that. All right. Let's move this set out of the way and let's open up some more. Okay, so this basically, I'm guessing, is telling me what I have. So each egg, so this is kind of like the egg I already opened, so that's good to know. Let's see if the egg that's in there has the same. So does that go with that? And then there's a blue and purple one. What do you think? This one goes with this one maybe, and this one goes with this one? I don't know. There are a lot more cards. Let's just get to cracking, huh? Let's get to cracking them eggs open. I think that's the most exciting part. So this one's got a really neat purple top and they have different patterns and textures on them too. So it looks like they have a nice little variety of eggs. Let's see. Okay, I think I was somewhat right on that one. There's the first one. What do you think? Just kind of, yeah. So the bottom is the easiest way to get into these. And then you almost don't want to look at the cards. Now, the last one, I'm not going to even look at the cards. Not till I'm done. Because now I know I've got a duplicate. Oh, wait a minute. I don't have a duplicate. This one's somewhat translucent. Okay, look at that. So... That one's pretty cool, and you can almost see through it. All right, now the cards, I'll just lay these out real quick. Is anybody playing this game? I mean, it looks very, um, uh, what's the word I wanna use? Similar to another game with figures and cards. Uh, so basically, you know, this is for a new generation of kids who didn't grow up on that other game. I'm sure you know which one I'm talking about. I'm not going to say it. But, you know, it kind of has that feel to it. So maybe that's kind of what they're going after with this. Oh, and there was this extra card that uh, battle icons, what they mean, their traits, their factions, okay. And then a bunch of numbers and columns there in rows. Then this card... Uh, Power of Alchemy, Common, Rare, Mystics, Legendary Mystics. And again, promoting the app. And then this larger brochure. Is this how it's played? This must be how the game is played. Okay, that's a different language, so let's ignore that. Let's just take a quick look here. Karts Dragon, Karts Combat Presentation. Can't read any of that. Okay. Can't read any of any of that. Okay, so the one is completely in a different language. No wonder why they give you two. That's better. 
sometimes I was thinking it's one side and then the other side, but it's not. It is one set was one language and the other set is the other language. Battle requires two players, six Dragon figures, six Dragon cards, and 30 battle cards. Okay, so you need to get a big set to get this going. Let me move this out of, way, out of the way. Let's check out the next set. All right, I have not looked at my cards, so these are the two that were already out. I'll have to kind of scan them all later because, you know, could this be that it's two of the same right off the bat? And then look at this one. It's got you know, like a brown speckle on it. Pretty neat. I really do like the eggs. I think it would be neat if you were able to keep these eggs intact, but since you kind of have to break them somewhat to get out your little figure. Okay, ooh, he's pretty, he's got like a dragon-like skeleton. Okay, so I was kind of worried about that. Looks like I have some dupes. Please don't tell me that you get two of the same in a pack like that. Ooh, look at him. He's another almost translucent kind of creature. Okay, so it is different. Good. Uh, the difference is the wings. It looks like the same figure, but a different color scheme on there. Okay, those are all open. Now, I did see this now. Knowledge of English required. I, I do want to read through that, so I'm going to just lay these cards out. I do want to kind of get an understanding of the game. So you got similar cards like that. Now there is the ones I just got. Like I said, if you don't want to know what you got, don't look at the cards first. Okay, and then let me just... There's a huge pack. I mean, you get that nice card feeling when you zip through them. You got scalding claws, feel the heat, red rain, it looks like a interesting uh, licked up, poison peril, double trouble. Wow, there's just a lot here to fit. They will not all fit within my camera's viewfinder. Okay, quick camera change. I will get these all laid out so you can take a look at all of them. There are so many. Let's get you guys out of the way. <laughs> Bonfire. Volcanic Bash. Ooh, looks like I can do it. I just need to do this. Okay, there's a lot there. Scalding Claw, like I said. Entombed. Roll the Bones. Soul Steel. Shadow of Doubt. Time Freeze. Ghost Charge. Singed wings. Okay, interesting. Let me grab my phone. Let me grab the app. I want to read through this. It'll take me a little bit, but you won't know that. I'll just come right back. All right, here we go. The app not available. I looked in Spin Master, which I'm doing right now, and then I've also just searched it. It is not ready. The Bakugan one that I did last time is there, and it's installed, so just not available yet. We're early on in the process. Shuffling. Okay, so you put out your three for each player. The logo on their card goes up. So this is Razor Bark. Okay, and then now you deal out five behind each one. One, two, three, two, two, three. Now notice the colors are different. Three, two, three, four, two, three, five, two, three. Okay, I guess you could do it this way too. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So now you see the battle set is that. Everything you need for your first match with your opponent. All right, so I'm going to read on now. So now we're set. So the player who lost the last battle or the youngest player goes first, you can also flip a coin. We will just, I'm just going to kind of... Uh, Kind of, what, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, shuffle my way through this, I guess. So decide which Dragonmon to use and which enemy you want to attack. So you are deciding who you're going to attack and which one you're going to attack. Push both Dragonmons forward. So you probably tell them, I'm going to attack this one. So you're going to push this one forward and then you're going to push this one forward. Okay, so now they have moved up. Draw the two top cards from your chosen deck. Okay. 
Choose one to use and place it face down next. Okay, make some room here. And place the other at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so now you're flipping. I guess you're kind of mixing cards up. Let's put this one here. I guess you can look at them and choose, but I don't know yet, you know, what it matters. Because I have not learned that, but I guess if you're looking at two cards, you're going to want to pick the one that's got the higher attack, maybe. It's something you got to learn here. And then make that a decision. All right, I'm going to read a little bit more. Come back and see what happens now to the ones in the middle that are battling. Here, let me do it this way. So these two are battling. All right, so I reset this up so you can kind of see. All right, and I'm not going to actually do too much more gameplay because there's a lot more here. Most battle cards have a bonus, allies versus enemies, charge icon, building your own deck. So that is something you're going to have to study. There you go. I'm giving it to you to study. But the basic system now is each player flips their card. So you're flipping your card. One. And you're both flipping. If you are attacking, add your attack number to the boost number. So the attack number is down here and then the boost number is up here so I have 70 if you are counterattacking add your counterattack number to the boost number so counterattack number hmm oh so I guess it's 30 40 20 10 this one is going to win if it is a tie both dragon mounts retreat and the next fight begins Okay, and it's a deck, but okay, the Dragomon with the lowest total is defeated. Remove the Dragomon and its deck from the battle. And place the winning Dragomon battle card at the bottom of its battle deck. Okay, so now we are here, and now your opponent now is going to battle you in the opposite direction. I think uh, I got some of it, but I think you get a little better understanding of how it's played and set up. And there you go, and thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. Normally I bring everything out, but I think I've taken enough of your time. Hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching. Later! If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh yeah, please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up.